Hi, Oscar. Six questions with Oscar. Six tests with Oscar. Six questions with Oscar. Question number one. If a woman doesn't like to run, what is the best cardio that a woman could do at LVAC? Well, Natalie, the great thing about LVAC is that here we have many options for you. If you don't like running, um, the elliptical was actually originally designed for people who were injured with running. Um, it was a way that it was a way that they could mimic or simulate the same movement as running, same sort of pattern. I'm gonna, it's on an elliptical machine, so we have we have a ton of cardio equipment. Even if you if you don't like the elliptical, we have the stair steppers, other other forms of cardiovascular equipment that you can do if someone doesn't like one particular thing, or even if you get bored of doing the same thing, it's always good to cross train. Ten of number two. Is it a myth that a stair stepper gives you a big butt? Um, yeah, I mean, for, for the stair stepper to accomplish that, then maybe you might have to be wearing a weight vest, um, or do some type of load bearing to where it's it's, it's going to work your butt, but it's you're doing you're working the endurance muscle fibers to where you're not really going to those type of muscle fibers don't really have the ability to build as you're doing it maybe somewhat, but not not like the equivalent of like doing squats. Test number three. What do you think the biggest problem that women have when they go to the gym? Um, just just the fact that they don't seek out professional guidance. You know, they try to either do their boyfriend's workout or. Basically, don't they, they don't have any direction. I mean, here at LVAC, we have you know, trainers, we have we have classes, group exercise classes where you're, you're getting a. So for most of the time, the, the personal trainers teach uh, group instruction. Question number four. I read an um, article that protein shakes were not really that great for you. Is that true? Well, it depends. I mean, just because I'm mean, here at the juice bar, just because it's here at, the, at a gym, you would think it's healthy, but it doesn't necessarily mean it's healthy. Loaded up with sugar, loaded with calories, depending on what your goal is. Just remember five, six. <laughs> what What do you recommend uh, someone to eat after a workout? Um, just you know, we all know what's eating. It's just a matter of maybe just relearning these things, like getting a balanced diet, with protein, your carbs, and your low low fat sources of, uh, of fat, and your good fats. Um, so yeah, I mean, there's nothing, there's nothing new. It's just a matter of busy mom that works and maybe even a single, what would you uh, recommend to them if they, let's say they could give you three days a week, would you say is 20 minutes a day enough really or are you wasting your time? That's better than not doing anything. Better than sitting on the couch. Yeah, definitely uh, any little time that you can devote to exercise and it, it doesn't even have to be in the gym exercise, you know. Uh, just not always looking for that closest parking spot, you know, taking the stairs, simple things that you can make your day a little bit more active. Ha, 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 ha.